hey, it's your girl A, and today's video is being brought to you by Eunice Hair, which you can find them on Amazon. Y'all know what I be saying about Amazon? Amazon Prime, get your stuff on time, girl. So I did take the liberty of sewing in an elastic band in this unit, and I've actually went ahead and bleached the knots, and I didn't even have to pre-pluck the hairline. Not at all, I don't recall. But this is how your unit comes from your niece from Amazon. So make sure you check them out. I'm telling you that there ain't no other way. Pack your bags and then you will go away. I'm not gonna be begging you to stay. Mm -hmm. So maybe if you asked me yesterday, I would handle this differently. Things are different, I'm a new. That's not gonna happen. That's not gonna happen. That's not, that's not gonna happen. So, even if you're asking, even, even if you're asking, cause I do what I do. And it's time for something new. Yeah. Gotta know. Stuck in a spot, telling you it ain't what I thought. Don't wanna be stuck in a spot, cause I don't really like what I got, so I change it. They pop it, it's not ungrateful, just being helpful for me. Cause we gotta go our own way, gotta, gotta go our own way. Yeah. This was not a good day, gotta, gotta go our own way. Cause I do what I do. It's time for something new So being that this wig fit perfectly, I didn't have to customize it by cutting over the ear tabs. And being that it's an HD lace frontal, this should be super easy. Okay, okay. So I'm gonna go ahead and flip my wig up just a little bit in the front, so that way I can put on my favorite hairspray, which is the Aussie Instant Freeze. Guys, if you haven't been one of my subscribers for so long, then take it from me, this is the best hairspray ever. I have been using it for probably about 10 years and it's amazing. It will definitely hold your wig down in place, but it'll also hold the style that you curl your wig in too, girl, okay? It instantly dries super quick and you can put about two to three or more barriers of hairspray on your hairline prior to adhering your unit. Try to make sure that it gets a tacky surface and it does dry pretty quick so try to be a little bit quick about it um, you don't have to use a blow dryer depending on the lace I'm gonna go ahead and use a blow dryer because I did spray quite a bit and I didn't wait for it to dry all the way or get tacky all the way but just listen and t let me tell you make sure that you allow it to get tacky it will definitely hold in place okay excuse me there allergies kicking in but as you guys see from the hairline, it's super natural. You don't really have to do too much customizing. And if you do forget a spot in the front or on the sides that hasn't gotten any type of hairspray, spray the tip of your comb and just slip it onto the lace and you won't have to worry about your lace lifting. Now, like I said, I'm going to take a blow dryer because I did spray a little bit too much, 
So I'm just going to be pressing the lace into my actual hairline. And I'm also going to be spraying behind, excuse me, I'm going to be pressing down with my comb behind the hairs. This will allow the hair not to lay so flat, but it'll also help it be a little bit more realistic. And a girl can never be without any type of sideburns. I'm not gonna do any type of baby hairs in this unit because as you'll see in a few minutes, you definitely won't need any. This is one of my favorite hair uh, styling mousses, which is the Got To Be Smooth Operator. This is their luxury mousse. And then there's the Got To Be Volume Maniac or Maniac. And then there's also the Got To Be Fantastic, which is not being sold anymore. But quite honestly, the Volume Maniac is definitely the same as the Fantastic. So for this video, I'm gonna just show you guys two different styling mousses by Got To Be, and you can be the judge of which one is any different. But for me, I do feel like they're both the same. So being that they still do sell the Maniac, Volume Maniac, you can definitely pick that up. And I'm just going to take the styling mousse and brush my hairs back so that way you can see my skin, it'll lay flat, it'll lay flush, it'll look like it's growing out of my scalp, girl, okay? And I didn't really do that great of a job with spraying it down this time around, but it will stick. Trust me, it's going to stick. Now, as you guys seen, I did use the Got To Be Volume Maniac. And I do feel like it's honestly the same as the Fantastic that I absolutely love because they both give you volume as they stay on the can and they also have collagen in them. Now this is the Smooth Operator and I'm not really sure if they sell this one anymore but I was just trying to do kind of like a little test here to see if there was any different because you guys know companies can put their products out and say something is different about them and quite honestly the product will be the same just a different name on it and a different price tag but i will be honest and say about the aussie instant freeze you can definitely tell the difference between their hairsprays there is the instant freeze by aussie which is great and then there is the volume one which doesn't give you as much hold so if you're looking for that great superior hold to lay your wigs down then you definitely want to check out the aussie instant freeze now I'm just gonna spray some water with some conditioner onto the hair, just to bring the curls back a little bit. And then I'm also going to be using some of my hairspray, excuse me, my mousse. So on one side, I'm going to be using the Volume Maniac. And this gives beautiful curls, well-defined. I wouldn't say just go ahead and put this on the curls dry. I would say, you know, give it some dampness. And now I'm gonna take the Collagen Fantastic one and put it on the opposite side. To me, they both give the same, absolutely the same type of curl pattern. And you can tell that they feel the same. I've noticed from my favorite styling mousse from the Dollar Tree that it doesn't have the same texture and feel as the Got To Be styling mousse. But if you have your own favorite that you like to use, but then by all means, don't go out and buy what I'm suggesting. Just use what you've got. Now, do you guys see that hairline? It looks really cute, really nice, really natural. For a wig from Amazon, girl, you don't have to do much at all. This one is 18 inches. It is a curly one. I do honestly like the curls a lot better once it's washed versus, you know, spraying water on it because once you wash, the curls are so much more juicier and thicker versus spraying them on a daily basis. inches is a decent wig and you know Amazon they got you covered if you have prime you get your wig on time you get free shipping and also you definitely want to check out Eunice's Amazon store they have plenty wigs and such to choose from I decided to put the hair back on one side just so you guys can see how versatile it is for the length but also how natural the sides look as well for an Amazon wig girl Hey, I'm saying save your coins, check out your niece hair, and let me know what y'all think of it, okay? If you 
you're definitely looking for some summer hair, some spring hair, or what have you, nothing too wild and crazy, then this is probably the wig for you. Super easy, just bleach the knots, and girl, you are good to go. So I hope you guys all enjoyed this video with your girl. Make sure you hit that thumbs up. Make sure you hit the thumbs up, and I will definitely see y'all in the next one. Stay diva and divalicious. Stay blessed, stay safe, and as always, I love you guys, and I will definitely see you in the next one. And if you're in a store, check out the Got To Be Styling Moose. Check out the Volumaniac. That's one of my faves. I love you, and I'll see y'all in the next one. All right? Bye.